Howdy everybody, Brian here from quantlabs.net. Today is Sunday, November 1st, 2020, 7.48 p.m. 48 hours to go to the USA election. I'm going to talk about that, what people loading up. There's a lot of uncertainty in the markets right now. Uh, when you're looking at the various um, CFDs available on, on uh, Oanda, it's how we do the Measurement of uh, what's getting loaded, where and how and why and where. So let's go over to MotoWave. So what we have here are 110 instruments representing all the major parts of the economy. I've done my scan. Uh, let me just do it again. It'll take a little while. What we do is we look for excellent score and where our harmonic scan we don't care about the pattern, as long as the harmonic scan, where it says the target date is higher than the current price. Uh, another roundabout way of saying long. <laughs> so shorting is a tough game, let's be honest. So we're looking for excellent scores right here. All right, so uh, find this a strange one. Uh, US 2000. Let's just make sure we got everything scanned okay so usd 2000 uh has a long uh would make sense but you can see it's been very flat not a lot of performance out there continuing along lots of shorts this one's been pretty interesting a british pound against the australian dollar uh that's a nice long but it's been flat very little opportunity Again, British pound against the Canadian. Uh, you can see here, we can tell that the U.S. dollar is fairly weak because we're not getting all the strong scores in U.S. dollar, which tells you, um, I'll be doing another video entry. on the newer bots, as you can hear it in the background there, the entry exit voice. Um, so we'll continue along here. Not a lot of long, folks. I hate to disappoint you. Um, so we have here virtually nothing. It just says that they're, they're expecting not a lot going on in the market. I think there's a benefit out of that will be definitely crypto. I'll show you the bot, uh, two bots uh, for that in, a min in, in the next video. So if you are interested, wait for the posting. And we'll see what happens. Okay, okay, we found something. So we found uh, sugar. Sugar is an interesting one where if there's nothing else, sometimes you may find a commodity might start to move. Um, sugar may be one of them. Uh, last year, remember, this thing moved quite a bit. So uh, that might be something to watch. That's why I add it to this. Um, now we get into the very good. A lot of these are okay to watch. These can be useful for those uh, Entry. once the markets open up tomorrow, they'll probably start trading. We'll see them move from very good to excellent. One of them, I'm so whoa, uh, USB the Treasury 30 years down. Wow, they, they really don't feel too good. Okay, so the USD uh, Swiss franc is up. The um, U.S. Uh, China won is up. You can see it's been a, in a really bad decline. I don't know when it's going to fall about. This one's looking okay. Uh, let me just see here. This is the USD Hong Kong dollar. Yeah, we can see how crazy it's gone. This, this does not appear to have a lot of um, liquidity in it. Uh, USD HUF not be an interesting one. I could see this moving You can see here. It's kind of eking up. That's a USD Hungary And there's just so many So many shorting um, Not a lot out there Just probably might be safe to take a holiday and not be in the markets this week for some that uh, 
can't handle it. <laughs> uh, I'm just not seeing a lot of opportunity out here, unfortunately, um, which means not a lot of clarity. Uh, I will even 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 the standbys like GBP in Poland would be an interesting one, but that's a short too. Jeez, everything's looking down. Even the Treasury's ten year. Wow. Lots of 10 year shorts out there. I don't know why. They don't probably look too good. We have a UK. Yeah, no, those are mixed there. Uh, what I've already said, not a lot to choose from. Euro and British pound. Even the Norwegian's not doing too good. Euro and the Norwegian. Uh, uh, very disappointing. The metals are not being seen anywhere at all. This is mostly currencies, but sugar is an interesting one. Uh, Entry. Still not give up here. It's all over the place. So here we have some gold. You can see the shorting there. It doesn't matter what currency you pick off. Let's say uh, USD, it's all shorting. Even Germany uh, tenure is down, the Deutsche, or sorry, the Bund. Sugar's probably out of the lot looking your best. Uh, I wouldn't put a lot of money on it. Wow. Okay, I guess we leave it at that. Not very much going on. Uh, a few out there that might be okay, but I think it's just time to take a holiday. Other than that, uh, we shall talk to you later. Thanks for watching. Have yourselves a good day.